Kids. Welcome to my YouTube channel, History for Kids. Today, I am going to start a new series, Know About the Country series, Friends. Today, I am going to cover Russia. This is part one. It's divided into three parts. In this series, I am going to cover the geography of Russia. So, let's start this. You know, in this photo, who is this gentleman? This is Vladimir Putin, a president of Russia, friends. Friends, let's begin. Friends, let's move to the next slide, friends. Friends, this is our lovely country called India. And now we are going to North and this is Russia, friends. Friends, this is, the, the, I will say you the neighboring seas of Russia. It's Barents Sea, Kara Sea, Lapipit Sea, East Siberian Sea and Chechiki Sea and uh, Bering Sea, friends. Friends, and this is Alaska, friends. When Nicholas II became the uh, Tsar of Russia, friends, he sold this Alaska to US, friends, and this is US, friends. Friends, and, and the problem and it was a very big blunder why they sold Alaska to USA because Russia, this is the first port, first foreign port of Russia and now they have only the coal ports friends and this was a very big blunder of Russia and this, this was the these are the dangerous countries for Russia, friends, because they, this is a very plain land for, and they, these three countries can attack Russia, friends, Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania, friends, and Russia. Now, how, how Russia can have a supporter, friends, friends, and then its capital, Russia's capital is Moscow. Estonia capital is Tallinn, Lithuania's capital is Riga, and Lithuania, no, Latvia's capital is Riga, friends, and Lithuania capital is Vilnius, friends, and and these Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan, Turkmenistan, Tajikistan, Kyrgyzstan are the part of Russia. That time they were part of Russia after. When Russia split into 15 countries, friends, and now these countries are independent, friends, and and it shares, it has a very good reserve of uh, fresh water, friends, and it shares pipelines with uh, all the European countries and with Turkey, friends, and Turkey is over here, friends, friends. Let's move to. I'm going to cover the geographic features of Russia, Russia friends. It's rivers. Four of the countries and five along the rivers, friends. Hope, Aitish, Abur, Leda, and Yedisi are in Siberia. All but the Aibur flow north, northward into the Arctic Ocean. The longest European river is the Volga, which flows southward into the Caspian Sea. The, the Volga is famous for its major role in Russian history, friends. The Volga is the longest river in Europe, which 3531 kilometers length and catchment uh, area and in 136000 kilometers. It is also Europe's largest river in terms of discharge and drainage basin, friends. And friends, this is map of the uh, Volga River and you can you can um, pause my video and see the map of Volga River, friends. Friends, I'm trying to erase this thing, friends. Okay, friends, let's move to the next slide. To cover the second geographic features of Russia, friends, it's mountains. Major landforms include the Cactus Mountain, Altai Mountain, Ural Mountains, and Mount Elbrus, Kamachtaka Peninsula, Siberian Plain, Siberian Plateau, and the Stanvoy Mountain. Mount Elbrus is the highest mountain in Russia, friends. Friends, this is the this is the photo of Mount Elbrus, friends. And isn't it interesting? And it's beautiful, friends. And it's border of Russia and Georgia, friends. Friends, I'm trying to erase this thing. Friends, I'm trying to erase this thing. 
Okay, friends, let's move to the. Okay, friends, I'm going to ask you a question, friends. Russia is in Europe or Asia? Some people will say Europe, some people will say Asia, but the actual theory was given by Philip John Vaughan and Stalin Berg, who was Swedish geographer and German origin friend. He has said the dividing line is Ural Mountains. In the last geographic features, I have made you learn the Ural Mountains, friends. The part of Russia is, is in the left hand side of Ural Mountains. It is Europe and the part of Russia in the right hand side of Ural Mountains is, is in Asia. It is in no, not interesting friends. Okay friends, this is, you can pause my video friends and you can see the map. This is, this is West, West Russia friends and this is Europe, Russia and this is East Russia, it's uh, Asia, Russia friends friends this is Ural mountains friends friends i'm trying to erase this thing friends okay friends let's move to the next geographic feature friends it's lakes top eight biggest lakes in russia as you see this lake is located on the border of Russia and Europe and washes the shore of five countries Kazakhstan, Russia, Iran, Azerbaijan and Turkmenistan. Kazakhstan capital is Astana, Russia capital is Moscow which I which I'm going to explain you friends. Iran's capital is Tehran, Azerbaijan's capital is Baku and Turkmenistan capital is Bashar B friends. The second lake is Lake Baikal. And the third lake is Lake Lodeja, and the fourth lake is Lake Oneja, the fifth lake is Lake Timur, and the sixth lake, seventh, sixth lake is Lake Hadka, and the seventh lake is Lake Chennai, and the eighth lake is Lake White Friends. And friends, you can see the, you can pause my video, and you can see the, you can see the map of. Map of Lake Baikal, friends. Lake, ba lake Baikal is the deepest and oldest lake in the world and the largest freshwater lake by volume, friend. Friends, I'm trying to erase this thing, friends. And friends, let's move to the next slide. Friends, hi, friends. This is the slide. This is on the climate of Russia. You can see, friend. You can pause my video and see the map of climate of russia friends the summer is hot and dry but the winter is extremely cold it's minus 30 degrees cent centigrade friends so cold friends so how can they survive i have shared a map which shows the climate of different regions of russia you can pause my video and look at the map closely friends friends let's move to the next slide friends Going to cover the environment of Russia. It's called animals, friends. Animals native to Russia, friends. Eurasian otter, one of the most recognizable animals, friends. In the Russia, is the Eurasian otter whose habitat extends over much of Russia, friends. And it's animals, friends. Northern flu seal, Amur leopard. Sable, Siberian tigers, friends, and ordinary stork, Belgu whale, and long-tailed gorilla, friends. Friends, I'm trying to erase this thing, friends. Okay, friends, I'm going to explain you a photo. These are Siberian live. Russia's Berich forest, friends. You have to remember. Anytime I can ask you with the comment box, but are also found in China and North Korea. Friends, ha 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 ha. It's found in China and North Korea. These are the communist countries. Ha 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 ha. There are habitat ranges for, for Siberia to the forest and the uh, Abu Basin's friends. Friends, let's move to the next. The fourth environment of Russia, friends, it's plants. Russian forests are rep represented prominently by boral Rural forest plants, I can ask you anytime in the comment box and it's 88% main forest 
Palm tree spice species are Lawrence pines, Purus fir, Stendar birch, and Esteem. And friends, they, this is boron forest. It's a green color, friends, and it's very big, friends. Boron forest, and these are our other forest friends in Russia, friends. Friends, I'm trying to erase this. You can pause my video and you can see see these things, friend, the map of this forest is friends and friends are trying to erase this thing. Friends. Okay, friends, let's move to the next slide. Thank you to all of my viewers. I will come back with Russia part 2 in which I am going to cover the historical timeline of Russia, friends. I will come back with Mahabharata part 1. It's divided into three parts, friends. Stay tuned. Subscribe to my channel, friends. Thanks a lot, friends.